Hey, my name is Mariam, and I'm here to present an interesting new feature that we've made available for C-sharp developers using Visual Studio. If you've ever wondered why do I have to implement an interface if the source code already has boilerplate code or blueprint of what it supposed to look like, or if you've ever thought about why do I have to replace throw not implemented exception, especially if the method signature already has all the hints needed or the find all references is already telling us how to use it, then this video is for you. We've introduced a new feature called Implement with Copilot, which is basically trying to reuse all of the capabilities that Visual Studio has already known to all developers over the decades, which is light bulb and code actions. All of our focus as the productivity team was to make sure we keep the developers focus where it should be and how to delegate implementation detail of how to implement specific methods to Copilot itself. I can actually show you with example how this capability works. So first example shows with a single click of a button, we can replace the entire method body in one go within a few seconds, if not less. The second example shows even when we have method overloads in the same containing type, we can use the same capability and fix all in the document in one go. Waiting a few seconds, in the meantime, the developer might just think about the entire complex problem they're trying to solve rather than worrying about where is this method reference and am I implementing it coherently with the source code or not. Copilot will make sure the context within the source code is respected when trying to implement these methods. And you will see that in this third example where we're trying to implement the method and we do in fact make use of APIs that are made available to us through the data serializer field that's within this containing type. The preview window also allows us to cross-examine what's going to show up in the source code before we actually commit to it because it's going to be in multiple files in some cases. In this example, you'll see we are going to implement whatever's left in this project that's not yet implemented. And in fact, in this example, there's more than 20 methods that are going to be implemented in one go. This shows how we save more than 50 lines of code in one go in a few seconds. And everything that gets changed within these examples, you'll notice has no single keystroke made by the developer. It is all mouse click and right click and light bulb interaction. So if someone is trying to think about the entire workflow, they are not distracted by lower level implementations. This last example shows how if there's like a hundred implementations that need to happen within the same project, we are making sure to batch this change, not to do everything all at once when it does not make sense. So if you want to give it a try yourself, make sure you have Visual Studio 17, 14, Preview 5 onwards available with GitHub Copilot enabled. Find any thrown out implemented exception statement in the source code. Right click, find the light bulb that says implement with Copilot, either decide to it replace that one single statement or all in document or all in project. Judge it for your own code base. Let us know what you think and you can find us on .NET Rawson repository in GitHub. My name is Mariam. Thanks for watching. Mm -hmm.